Hey everyone, I hope you're all doing well. Thank you for tuning in. This is Ambi. Today, let us talk about Python variables. So, how do you first declare variables? This is we are declaring variables. Then we have a one. So, this is how we declare a variable. How do you redeclare a variable? A equals three, yeah. As you see now, the value of a is three. What did I do? I redeclare the variable, right? A, B, C is one, two, three. Now A is one, B is two, C is three. Let me show you another way. Batman, Superman, Bruce. Then we have Clark, no, Clark, Clark, Batman is Bruce, Superman is Clark. How do you concatenate variables? You want to join variables, right? So, variable concatenation, escape caps, M, yep. So this is how you do it, Batman plus Superman, but this doesn't seem right. So let me do this, alter this, Batman plus, I'll give a space here, then I will do Superman. All right, so Batman plus Superman, Bruce Clark. local and global variables mm. Batman is Bruce so here the variable name is Bruce the value is Batman let me define a function and then say Batman is Wayne return Batman so I have a variable here Bruce is its value inside the function I have defined another variable so it is global uh, this one is global global variable this is local variable because this is local because it can be accessible within this function only only inside this function so let's call this function hello so it returns wayne not bruce but if i do this f batman is Batman is Bruce. So now I get this because this is accessible globally, right? Uh, this Batman, this Batman is accessible locally. Then uh, let me do this control A, control C here. I'm going to do print. Batman is Batman then I will go here return I'll do F Batman is I'm going to run the function here itself what happens first it prints this Batman is Batman then it prints this sorry Batman is Bruce because here the Batman value is Bruce global variable gets printed out here then this function I'm going to run this 
but inside the, this function batman's value is wayne so local variable takes precedence over global variable so it says batman is wayne batman is bruce so local variable is accessible and takes precedence over global variable within the scope where it is defined a global variable is accessible everywhere you can also update or reassign a global variable uh, let me show you how let's say batman bruce again global let me check this again yeah it prints the global variable and then i have this function here same where should i change let me put a print statement here and i will also do one yeah so that you will know it's easy for us to understand if i will say two dot and I'll do Batman here. Yep. So here it prints a uh, Batman that is this Wayne. And let me redefine Batman here. Batman is Bruce Wayne. Right. are hmm, let me do this way okay so here instead of defining this what i will do here is i'll keep this batman and here i will do batman is bruce wayne so this entire what this entire function does is it prints this local variable batman and then it changes the value local variable value of the batman right then let me run this function hello and print f3 dot batman right so what happens batman is bruce and it prints wayne here right uh, because here it's wayne here I changed the Batman's value to Bruce Wayne, right? But again, it prints the global variable. So nothing happened. I mean, it didn't change. So why? Let me show you why. So all I have to do is take this out and I will say global Batman, right? So what I'm saying here is Batman uh, what I'm going to use here the variable I'm calling the global variable Batman or when I'm defining a variable I can declare it as global so inside the function itself um, so what I'm telling Python is okay uh, by default I know that if I uh, don't do this okay this is local but I want to define a global variable from inside the function so if you want to do that if you want to overwrite a global variable then you write a new variable and declare it as global like this and let us see what happens batman is bruce here i'm saying batman and second one is also it says bruce third one it says bruce i mean uh, third one here now i'm redefining bruce wayne it has bruce wayne right so third one here it's supposed to print the global uh, Batman, right? It's it prints Bruce Wayne. Here, as you can see, here it prints um, Bruce, but here it prints Bruce Wayne, right? So let me show you another one, Batman. You can also what if you want to delete a variable, right? So we can also delete a variable like this. I say Batman, Bruce. It's a global variable. I will say print Batman 
and then I also delete Batman right and then I will do print Batman so it prints out this line Bruce right and then I delete it so it deletes and then it says name Batman is not defined on the fourth line so I'm trying to print Batman again but it won't because it has been deleted here Uh, this you can do uh, when you want to manually clean up your variables you have a lot of variables once a function is done or uh, once a purpose of the variable is uh, over you can delete but I've seen most of the uh, scripters or programmers they just let it be because Python has an inbuilt mechanism to take care of that all, almost all high-level languages do so I think that's all I had for Python variables. Thank you for tuning in. You have a great one. Take care.